Hey guys, Kingsley here, also known as M. Thank you very much for tuning in to episode 20 of King's Tutorials. In this episode, I'm going to be showing you guys how to install the wearable backpacks mod for Minecraft 1.0.1.2, and we're going to be installing it using Forge. So the first thing you guys are going to want to do is go over to the first link in the description down below, which should take you to files.minecraftforge.net, more specifically the download page for Minecraft Forge 1.0.1.2. After I've currently downloaded the latest version of Minecraft Forge, which in my case is version 2259. And I've also downloaded the Windows installer of Minecraft Forge by pressing on the installer-win button right here, which will take you to an add focus page where you're going to wait 6 seconds and then press skip in the top right corner right here. And that will download Minecraft Forge for you. However, if you aren't on your Microsoft Windows operating system, I'd recommend you download the regular Java installer of Minecraft Forge by pressing on the regular installer button right here. So once you've downloaded Minecraft Forge, go over to the second link in the description down below, which should take you to the curse page. And then scroll down into, well, and more specifically the download page for um, the wearable backpacks mod. So, uh, go over to other downloads and download the latest version that's currently available of this mod, which in my case is version uh, 2.3.0 for, for Minecraft game version 1.9.2. So if you press on the file name right here, this will download the mod for you. Once you've downloaded both mods, drag them onto your desktop or somewhere where you can access them and then open up Minecraft. Once you're in Minecraft, you go to Launch Options, make sure you've enabled Advanced Settings, press on Add New right here. Name this profile Minecraft 1.11.2. Go over to the Version drop-down button right here, select Release 1.11.2. Press Save, go back over to News. If you press on your Profile Selection button right here, and then select the brand new profile you've just created, called Minecraft 1.11.2. Then press play. This will download and install this version of Minecraft for you. It shouldn't take too long if you have a fast internet connection as well. Now we're just going to let Minecraft load up uh, version 1.0.2 for us. And then we will begin to install Forge. There we go. Minecraft 1.0.2 has been successfully loaded. We can now press quit game and install Minecraft Forge. So if you open up Minecraft Forge that you downloaded earlier. Then make sure you select install client. Make sure this is also ticked. And then if you've relocated your Minecraft directory to a different location, you can press this button right here to locate your new Minecraft directory. But by default, it should be um, in app data, roaming, and then .minecraft. So w w once you're ready to install Minecraft Forge, press OK. This will download and install a brand new profile onto your Minecraft launcher called Forge. And I'm going to show you guys that right now. So if you open up Minecraft once again, then go over to launch options. You'll see a brand new profile has been created called Forge. And it's running the uh, re the version release uh, forge. See, release 1.1.2 forge, which is always at the very bottom of all these versions. So if we select that, press save, go back over to news. Then if we if we press our profile selection button right here, then select forge, press play, and this will uh, set up forge for us for the first time. And if this is your first time launching Minecraft Forge, it would also create a brand new profile in your Minecraft directory called mods. Alright, as you can see, Minecraft Forge has been successfully installed. We can we can go into mods and double check that, that everything is working fine. This is your child mods, by the way, is completely normal and, and you shouldn't worry about it at all. We can now press done, as, as we know that Minecraft Forge has been successfully installed for us. We can press quit game. And now we can actually install the backpacks mod. So, if, if you hold the Windows key on your keyboard and press R, this will open up run. And here you're going to want to type in percent app data percent forward slash dot Minecraft. I've left this command in, in the description down below so you guys can just copy paste it into your run and then once you're ready to press uh, OK well once you typed it in press either enter on your keyboard or press OK right here this, and this should open up your Minecraft directory and as you can see a brand new folder has been created called mods here we can drag in the wearable backpacks mod into the mods folder and I can launch Minecraft once again make sure you have selected the forge profile Alright, as you can see we have 6 mods loaded now instead of 5, and if we scroll down to the very bottom of the mods list, you can see that wearable backpacks has been, has been detected, by the way, 0 child mods once again, it's completely normal, do not worry about that, I'm going to create a brand new world and show you guys that the mod has been successfully installed. It spawned in front of a tree. Alright, whereabouts are all these backpacks located? There we go, backpack. I believe that's it. Alright, so thank you very much for watching this video, guys. I hope this has helped you out. If it has, make sure you guys leave a like and a comment down below. 
Let me know if this tutorial helped you at all. If it has, make sure you guys uh, subscribe to the channel. So yeah, thank you very much for watching this video. I hope this has helped you out. And I hope to see you guys in another one of my videos. Goodbye.